Hi there, welcome to another Mind and Draw video tutorial. Uh, today's video tutorial is all about coaster making uh, and I'm going to be giving you a wee kind of step by step guide on how to make a kind of standard coaster. All you need here is really some paper, uh, pens, pens with any kind of draw materials. So the first step really is think about a theme for the coaster. Uh, usually posters can be like stuff to advertise about, it could be an event or stuff like that. But also it could be a landmark as well, it could be any landmark. Uh, i just done one recently about World Earth Day 2020, so that's my theme I'm going to show you about in the next steps, is about World Earth Day 2020. So then the second step then is now thinking about a title for the poster, uh, and maybe a message just below it. So the title I've made was uh, just World Earth Day 2020, so that's my title, that's going to be my focal point for the the, the poster and I'm also going to put a wee message as well so I was doing a wee bit of research uh, about World Earth Day and all about climate change and about the environment and the one thing I came up to is you could do, that my message really is just recycle more you know that's my kind of message so my title is World Earth Day 2020 recycle more so that's kind of message there as well so that's my second second step done going into the first step is all about the kind of development side of it so now you've got your kind of title you've got your message you've got your theme uh, now you're going into the development phase. This is now where you think about the layout of the poster, what the size is going to be, uh, you're going to think about the colours what you're going to use, uh, you're going to think about the background, are you going to have a border, are you going to have a bit of artwork that's going to be designed for the poster which relates to the theme. Uh, so you're going to think about that. And these are, you can do about four or five sketches, many sketches you want, and it just have to be kind of small sketches, it doesn't have to be full masterpieces really you know these are just small rough sketches you know don't don't overthink it just this is all about experiment trying different ideas think about the size think about what colors and stuff just experiment with different colors don't worry about it and just go go with the kind of flow uh, do a bit of research beforehand look into what the theme is all about and you'll get some ideas popping out and then you just do a few sketches and just go from there so that's really the first step now you go into the fourth step and now you think about okay we've got a few sketches here five sketches what am I going to do with this? My kind of tip is maybe just pick one or two out. Say, I like this one here. I'm going to take this one forward. But I'm also like this one as well. I'm also going to take this one forward as well. So then I'm going to further develop it and further work on it. And I make them a bit bigger and add more detail into them. This is what I've done right now, actually. So I've got one here that I've just done here. This is one I took forward. So as you can see, it's not finished yet, but it's just that I've just done the text. But my kind of main issue was size. And that, that you couldn't really see the message so that was a bit of a problem there so i'm going to put this one back and then i started working on another one as well which made the kind of message a bit more clearer as well so this one here i've got the world day of day 2020 got the recycle more message down there but i've also added what from the sketches was well, the layout as well so i've added a bit of a border i've added a nice wee kind of background with trees and grass uh, with the sky as well still not finished but i'm still working it's a work of progress that's what development is all about so just testing it out and see what it's all about. So then you're going through the kind of next step, you've done a lot of development, you've done a kind of full development of the two ideas you, you took forward. Now it's kind of time to take one forward for your kind of final outcome and say that this is the one that I'm going to go for. And then you take one forward and you work on it. And that's going to be your next step. Make this as, as, as really kind of possible, good as possible. Uh, you know, size-wise, depends what paper you have. I'm just using A4 right now. But that'll be your next step. Just create the poster from all the research that you've done, all the development as well. So that's kind of a kind of rundown of what poster making is all about. Uh, what I'm going to do in the video description below is just put a kind of more detailed version of it. And also, um, as the sessions go on, I'm going to be doing different themes. I'm going to be doing poster making a lot through the different live streams I'm doing, and we're going to do different themes of poster making. So look out for that. Uh, I'm also going to be putting some of my kind of finished work online as well. I've just showed you some kind of sketches I've done, uh, but the final outcome's um, not done yet. Um, but what I'm going to do, I'm just kind of showing you what this video is all about. I'm just giving you a kind of run through of, of my thought, thought process on how I do things uh, with poster making. So I hope you enjoy this video and uh, if you've got any, any more uh, questions about poster making or mind draw in general, feel free to ask, feel free to message me on the details below and uh, look out for the next video. Uh, thanks.